For more videos, visit forthesakeofeducation.com. All right, guys, let's do this problem where you have to replace the loading by an equivalent resultant force and its location measured from O. So we got two geometrical shapes. We got a rectangle right here and a triangle right here. The force, the equivalent force on the rectangle acts right in the middle of the rectangle. Let's call it F1. And the equivalent force of the triangular loading acts at one third from the long edge of the triangle. Be right here, one third. So let's find the forces first. F1 is equal to the area of the rectangle, which has a width of two meters times a, a, a height of four kilonewtons per meter. So that will make F1 equal to 8 kilonewtons. F2, you gotta find the area of the triangle which has a height of 6 times a length of 1.5 divided by 2 because it's a triangle which will make the triangular loading have a, a magnitude of 4.5 kilonewtons. Both forces are aiming down so let's assume downward is positive so the resultant force is equal to F1 plus F2, which will be 12.5 kilo newtons. Now you need to find the moment of O, and to that you need to find the lever arms that are turning. So first you got this length, it's right at the half of the rectangle, which has a length of 2 meters, so half of the rectangle will be 1 meter. And F2 will be the length of the rectangle plus one third of the length of the triangle, which would make this distance uh, 2.5 meters. So let's find the moments of O. You got F1 turning the lever arm with length of one meter. So it's F1 times one meter. Let's assume clockwise is positive. So it's positive. And F2 is also positive because it's also turning it clockwise and it's turning the lever arm with a length of 2.5 meters. When you plug F1 and F2, which we found up here, into this formula, you get that the moment is equal to 19.25 kilonewtons per meter. Now, the location of this resultant force to create this moment about O is found by the moment O is equal to the resultant force times the distance D. D is what we're trying to find. D is equal to the moment O over F of R, which is equal to the moment is 19.25 kilonewtons per meter, and the resultant force is 12.5 kilonewtons per kilonewtons. So this is equal to 1.54 meters. Final answer for the distance, final answer for the moment, final answer for the resultant force F2 and F1. Please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.